Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. I wanted to do an unboxing for the Faye that I got at Wonderland of Play. Faye is by an artist called, I'm not sure if it's McCann or McCain, um, but if you know how to pronounce it, please leave me a phonetic pronunciation in the comments. I would appreciate that. But I was looking on YouTube, I couldn't find any videos about these amazing creations. So I thought, well, I'll do a little unboxing of mine. So how I got this is they had four available at Wonderland of Play and it was a lottery to purchase and so I put my name in and my husband put his name in. He actually got drawn first. Um, I like first in line, like I didn't get drawn, but he got drawn first of all the drawings. So I got first choice, which is really cool. When we we're outside waiting in line, there was a penny on heads on the ground and he picked it up and so we're convinced that that was the good luck that allowed his name to get pulled for the lottery for to purchase the Fay. So anyway, I wanted to show uh, my Fay to you guys because I'm really excited. I've been trying to get one for a while um, like everybody else has. They're very difficult to get because they're all handmade and they're sold mostly by lottery on Instagram. So I haven't even opened mine up and touched it yet because I was waiting to do that. Oh my gosh. So I am super excited. Now they are made of wool, wire, polymer clay, and fabric. I was looking at the um, information, and the eyes are plastic. I was looking at the information on McCain's um, Instagram that told about them. So I'm going to finally open and touch mine. And so I chose pink. There were four colors available. There's like a gray, green, pink, and the other color was maybe another like shade of gray. But, oh my gosh, how fantastic is this little one. Wow. I just kind of want to touch the face. So, wow, this is like, I guess this is needle felting. I don't really know holding a sprig of eucalyptus but on the instructions it says if you want to you can twist the head carefully and if you want to bend the arms and legs you have to do it from the base um, so as not to like put stress on the joints because I guess there's the, the wire armature in there this is so cool and this one is dressed by Alice's Tears look at that I think it's all Alice's Tears I think um, Halevi might have made the hat, but I'm not sure. But look at that. Wow. This is so, so, so cool. I am like so excited to get this. I did not expect, because I'll, I'm sure a lot of people put their name in for the lottery. And since I got chosen, so the total price for the entire package was $10.60. They cost a little less than that if you win them through Instagram because they don't come with all the extra stuff. But $10.60 was the price. The shoes are polymer clay. They are not removable. They are sculpted and baked onto the wire armature. Oh gosh, I love the feel in my hands. Like I really love the feel. Just look at the, the detail in the little face there. Like the shading in the mouth and the nostrils and how much expression there is on this little face. My gosh, it is so, so cool. And I really love too, I wanna to point out the box, how it has the wax seal there. I think that's such a special touch, um, just to add that touch of like luxury and fun to the item. So then I wanna show you guys what else. Um, well, let's look at the COA stuff. And if you hear something in the background, my washing machine is running. I thought it was done, but oh well. Um, so here's the McCain Fay made in Japan. This artist is in Japan. And I'll, of course, link their information uh, below so you can follow. But even the string that's used to tie up all this stuff is like sparkly, fancy, nice string. So I'm going to carefully... I'm gonna try to just kind of slide it off so I don't mess it up, there we go. So I've got that slid off and then let's open this up. So I, like again, was super thrilled to be able to get one of these because the, the best way to get it is to just get lucky basically in the lottery on Instagram or if you go to a show and get lucky in a lottery because these are, you know, they're one of, they're all handmade. Oh no, I got this stuck on the, on the COA. Oh no, don't pull it off. 
let's see okay um I just got lucky like and I didn't even get lucky it was my husband that got lucky so look at that that is so cute so this is um the, oh maybe they sold a few like when the doors open so I guess these are the ones for for the lottery I mean for the the event and I'm, I'm guessing maybe they sold a few when the doors open I had honestly thought they were gonna be sold when the doors open and we didn't get in until almost it was after 10 30 before we even got in the doors because the line was really long so I had thought they were completely sold out if you watch my video where I did the walkthrough of the show I realized that there was a lottery for them as I was filming in the booth and I saw lottery for Faye and I stopped filming at that point entered the lottery and then they let me go back and do the video of the face. Just look at the little paper clip. It's so cute. Okay, so let's see. Alice's Tears doll outfits. And this face came with a lot of really cool, um, cool accessories. So here is the photo of all the face. And that's mine right there. And then let's see what this, these are just, these might just be like postcards. Yeah, it is, it's a postcard. That's really cool. But they have like, you know, everybody, they're just so cute. And so they're, because they're handmade, you know, they're, they're not mass produced. And because they're so cute, a lot of people want one. So, you know, it's, they're, they're hard to get, but just be persistent. So about Faye, Faye is McCain's, McCain's original design handmade doll by needle felted wool. There are a variety of colors of them and they're all one of a kind, lovable creatures never exactly looking the same. The head is jointed to the body by thread. Shoes are handmade by polymer clay and they're not removable. Arms, legs, and fingers have wire inside. Posing face, hold the root of the arms and legs firmly as you bend them. Do not twist, it will weaken the joints. To help your face stand on its feet, press down on both feet upon a flat surface and adjust the body to balance. Please refer to Instagram highlights for short video clips. Faze are delicate art dolls. Um, very cool to maintain their appearance. Carefully trim the fuzzy wool with scissors. Nice. So that's nice that we got the little um, care instructions there. And then this says, thank you so much for adopting a Faye at Wonderland of Play in New York, New Jersey from McCain. That's so cute. And then this, what is this? This is, oh, waist back. Blythe Neck Faye. Cool. Is that? I'm not sure. Maybe that's just the, the size that that's referring to. So that's a really nice little package of information, COA and stuff. Now, the Faye also came with a little toy car. Isn't that cute? And this is a Hallmark car. So it's a nice quality little um, car. And then I think this is a carrying case from Alice's Tears. So let's open it up and have a look at it. I did not really um, pay attention to all the stuff that was included because I was just so excited to like put my name in for one. And again, I didn't even expect to, to get one. So I'm really thrilled that I did. Um, so there's, these are from Alice's Tears. And then Oh, cool. So there's another outfit. Oh, nice. So another outfit with a bag. And then look at this. This is a little carrying case. How adorable. So I'm guessing you can do like this. And then carry my fay around. Oh, that is so cute. That is so cute. I might need to take the hat off to get. Oh, no. I'm just awkward. Look at that. Oh, that's precious. So it's a little bag and you can tie it closed up top and then you have like a little crossbody to carry your fay in. That is super sweet. And I love that it has the matching outfit so you can do um, the outfit. I just want to take the hat off just to see for funsies. So I'm going to pull the, the ears out carefully. And, yep, yeah, this is by Halevi. So that's cool. I thought it was. It looked like it. So, I mean, one of these hats, you know, these are, these are kind of expensive hats. They're really nice. Um, so I'm happy mine came with one already. And I love the colors, actually. Oh, my gosh. Look. See how the little fingers are bent with the wire? 
That is too cool. So like these little fingers here, look at that. I'm gonna have to put these high, very high on a shelf, put, put this one very high on a shelf in my doll room <laughs> because my cats, this is gonna be something my cats, if they ever get a hold of, I'm gonna lose, lose my mind. And then I think this is another scarf. So it's the same color scarf that, um, that is already being worn. Um, so I don't, I'll probably give this to a matching Blythe, or maybe that's the point. Maybe the point is like to have a matching one for your Blythe because a lot of people like they they make a nice Blythe companion. So you can see kind of the size here with Blythe and Faye. So that's them. Let me clear all the extra stuff out so you can just get a pure view of Blythe and Faye side by side. And so that's why in this Blythe community they're so... Um, popular is because they make a great little companion to Blythe and I mean obviously they're an amazing art piece like this is just such a cool art piece just look at that I just love it look 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 oh my gosh the face I can't get over the face so I'm guessing like if I want to bend the arms I'll take it by the the base like that and just kind of be really careful and I'll need to be like, um, I'm gonna be very, I'm gonna try not to pose this a lot because I've had other wire armature things before where I've snapped the wires because I was a little too aggressive with the posing. So I'll have to be careful with that because this is like, this is like, it's kind of like priceless because they're so hard to get. It's like I wouldn't be able to replace it anytime soon if I were to mess something up. So anyway, I'm just thrilled for the ability to adopt one. So thank you very much to um, Jen of Earth Angel Studios for having them at your booth and giving people the opportunity to adopt them. Thank you very much to McCain, and I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly. And if not, please somebody correct me. And just thank you for creating such an adorable, adorable piece of art for us to have in our collections. So that is a Faye so that you um, kind of know what it is and have seen it in the hand so you can get an idea if you want to add one to your collection if you want to try to join in the next raffle that's done so anyway guys thank you so much for watching we'll see you in the next video bye bye I want to say a huge thank you to my patrons from patreon Lindsay S Leah W Doreen Z Janice H Mercedes W Cindy K Bear Sunflower Diane B Kelly L Shorna R Stephanie W Shalane C Penny P, Louisa's Knit Knacks, Marty G, Lynn, Lynn P, and Cindy L. Your support means so much to me and helps me continue bringing you great Dolly content. For more information on how you can become a supporter of this channel, check the link in the video description. Thank you!